like, oh, don't you love angels, whoever, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, yeah, well, you're not getting these angels, sister, because these expensive. I'm reselling these. Back up, girl. <laughs> Hi everybody. So I am here at the Goodwill in Ankeny, Iowa. Um, because I have a few minutes. I'm supposed to be picking up groceries, but they're not ready until three o'clock and it's two thirty, so I've got time. I've got a little bit of time. I'm gonna hop in here and see what they've got. And uh feel free to come with me. Let's go shopping. Let's see if we can find anything to resell. Okay, let's go shopping. So we're at Goodwill, as I said. I promise it's not going to be all this bumpy with the cameraing, the videoing, bad cart. This one's better. I don't know why they keep the bad carts. Just get rid of the bad carts. If you know they're bad, you know that the, the Goodwill people don't want to be listening to that. I know I don't want to be listening to that. I'll tell you what, this guy would not get out of my dang way. I'm sorry. I I know I'm being crabby. Let me tell you right now, I'm recording this at 1.56 a.m. And I am a little tired, so I might get a little edgy. But I will tell you, that guy would not stop coming up on top of me. And putting stuff. I'm like, hey. Six feet apart, man. So this was all Christmas stuff that I have seen and honestly, I did not take a super strong look at it because I am just, I'm, I'm guys, I, I'm mostly done with Christmas. I need, you know, to be fair, I will pick up a few Christmas things here and there, but they gotta, you know, they gotta be calling my name. This was not the day. I honestly, I've kind of had, there was too many people down the aisle, so I didn't go down there, but... These aisles are really tight. Like, some Goodwills are really spread out, but this one is not. I liked this thing. I thought it was really pretty. It's like a, I don't know, like a, a lidded dish, I guess. Um, but I didn't really, I thought it was pretty. It only had one little chip, you see right there. So, not so bad. I thought somebody would love it. I will say, I put it in my cart. I was going to buy it, and then I got it, and I decided not to. So, you know, you know how it is. But, yeah, I've been to this um, Goodwill, like, a ton of times, so I've seen a lot of stuff. I had not seen these figurines. I wasn't 100% sure who they were made by, but... I'm trying to be cool with the figurines because I get a little carried away with the figurines. I think it says Taiwan, but now I can't see. I just, yeah, I, I wasn't confident about them. I'm trying to do better about like only picking things up that I'm confident about. And while I say that, let me go ahead and contradict myself because <laughs> I picked this up because I thought it was funny. It's a little schmid kitty. And it says dunce. He's got a dunce cap on, poor buddy. He, did. he can't help it. I thought that little yellow dish was pretty too, but I left her behind. I'm a sucker for figurines, you guys. I really am. I should have grabbed her. I don't know what I was thinking. Hello, Valentine's Day, you goofball. Should have grabbed that. I thought this would have been pretty, but I didn't know what it... Like, obviously, I think it's for a lamp. But I could be wrong. I left it because I wasn't 100% sure. Yeah, that's pretty, huh? I think it is. I left her, though. For today. For this time. This was pretty. wasn't marked, though. I just left it. I really like that type of, uh, like, I don't, I don't know, dishes, I guess, what they are. They're just very, uh, I don't know, 
fancy. And I'm not I'm not quite fancy. Very chic, I guess. I'm I'm and I'm not that at all, which is why I think I like it. Oh yeah, sorry, this was on the top shelf, so I was like struggling to get it. <clears throat> it's a you know, it's a bro guy sitting by a cactus taking his chill time. Um, I put that in my cart and then I think I decided against it. And I think it was because I could not get the lid to go back in there right. And then I was like, if I struggle with this, I bet you somebody else is going to. So, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just trying to be a little more picky. This was very pretty. I'm, also, I'm a little bit regretting not picking it up now. Kind of wish I would have, but should have, could have, would have. I sm saw it's smaller friend, so I grabbed that. She's pretty, especially for Valentine's Day. I like her. Maybe I'll maybe I'll pretend to be an assemblager, like my mom. See if I can try some things out. Oh my god, I loved these. So there were these cool plates that they looked like they were for a miniature tea set. Um, they have a dragon on them. I love that, you know, just like that strong Asian culture stuff. Now, I think this is going to be where I realize there's more. And you know what? I'm looking at this and it was not, that guy must have been putting it on the shelf. Like after I walked away because I thought this was really sweet but I left it because I don't because I'm dumb I don't know <laughs> I don't know why I left it I'm trying to think of a reason why I would have left that but oh look a little zebra planter I know that you guys be loving your planters I do too so I grabbed that puppy this was funny to me it's it's like a vintage coin bank it's not like a it is a vintage coin bank of grandma and grandpa rocking. Made in Japan. It's very sweet. Yeah, see? Th those are the cups that go with those plates. And I am now eating my words because those were definitely there. I just didn't see them. I'm telling you guys, I'm looking at a video and I can't even see it, so... You know, that's not great. <laughs> this guy's cute. He was like a Dollar General piece, but I thought, I, I've seen him several times. I think he's just cute. He's just a little squirrel doing his thing, doing squirrel stuff. You know how it is. This was cool, but now why did I not get it? Are the flowers chipped? Sam. Oh my Lord in heaven. I don't think they were. You big dum dum? Oh, I'm still looking at it. Oh no, that's a little girl. Hey, little girl. I didn't get her because she looked like she was supposed to have something in her hands. And I, I try not to sell things without the pieces that are supposed to be with it. This I've seen several times, and I get tricked every time because it has a giant chip in the front. I want it every single time. Ooh, yeah, this was pretty. I just, I didn't know who made it, if it was modern. Pretty sure it is. I need to get somewhat like some sort of like wearable device while I'm recording because like especially shop with, shop with me is because like it is so hard for me to reach. Whew, reach the top shelf as it is. So, you know, it's kind of, it, the videoing goes a little bit by the wayside when I'm trying to reach. That little guy was really full of personality. He was cute.
I thought these probably were something pretty back in the day, but there was too much wear on them, you know, so I left it. I believe I grabbed this, actually. It's like a little, not little, it's big. It's a big mug with a, with a, with a buck on it. And I loved the design of it, so... I thought somebody would appreciate that because it's just really pretty. These were cute, but I think they were pretty modern, so I just left them behind. This, my friends, I believe is a fairy lamp she's tall but by definition I would call her a fairy lamp she's got an area in which you can set a tea light or lamp accoutrement and she's got a cover and she's got a hole in the top looks to me like a fairy lamp wouldn't you say I'm thinking yes Oh, this was pretty. I love that metal on the bottom of that. Lady, don't be coming. Please don't. Please don't come down my aisle while I'm in the aisle already. Oh, yeah, I saw that. And I, I hadn't had a feeling it was not vintage. But I thought it, because the colors were so cool. I would just grab it and take a look. It was definitely painted on or flashed on or whatever, but still fun. <laughs> so now I've just taken to taking my flashlight and kind of like quickly shining it over everything on the glass shelf. <laughs> It's an interesting business model, but it works for me. Oh yeah, there was something under here. And I was so excited because it looked like a little working train set. Let's see if I can, you know, get to it. Now, that part looks great. Spoiler alert, prepare for devastation. I big old hole in it. Why are we not just pulling those things? It's too much. Especially for something that's broken. <clears throat> okay, why am I just sitting here? Oh, some cute bunnies. I don't know how vintage they were, but they were cute. And they're, you know, all bunny love. Doing what bunnies do, you know. You know. Oh my God, okay. So here's, here's where I noticed something very important. Do you guys remember these Bing and Grondel um, angels that I found and I believe I do not I can't remember off the top of my head who I sold them to but I know that I sold three of them for like $22 well I had just found tw all 12 of them at $2 a piece so I paid $24 for all 12 I will definitely make way more than that I was shocked of course I can hardly reach up there there was a lady to my left that you can't see who was like on top of me who was I mean and she was like saying because that girl that you can see over there was saying to the girl that was like behind me or to my left 
like, oh, don't you love angels, whoever, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, yeah, well, you're not getting these angels, sister, because these expensive. I'm reselling these. Back up, girl. These, they're so cute, too. They're beautiful. And Bing Grondel, they just make some really incredible, like, pieces. They just, they, there's a reason why they're expensive. They're just, <laughs> there was me being like, hey, be cool. We got them. We got them all. See, and there, there's that guy. Come on, man. Let me revel in my celebration. Yeah, I was very excited to grab those. I, oh, I loved these little birdie salt and peppers. So fun for spring, especially for you chic lovers. Fun, 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 fun. Oh, yeah, I grabbed this, uh, this little recipe book here. There weren't any recipes in it, which I was disappointed about because I love, 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 love to see old recipes, especially like, um, from families or whatever. Um, I just, yeah, I love them. I, I, it always makes me think of my grandma because she wrote all of her recipes down on index cards and her handwriting was the best. I thought this was cool. I think it's pretty modern, but I thought it was cool. I put it back, but mainly because I was like, well, eh, I don't know. I mean, if I, I think about what, like what I would do with it and that's kind of dumb, but <laughs> I just, yeah, I, I wasn't feeling it, I guess. Not this time. That's okay. What you looking at there, Sam? There you go. Oh, it was a little um, cup that somebody had turned into a pin cushion. I didn't get it because I thought that the um, the glue that they used didn't look very good. But that was just me. Somebody will really like it. The cups were made in England, I believe. And oh, this guy was made in Japan. I did not grab it. I don't. Again, I I don't. I can't give you a reason why. Wasn't feeling it, I guess. That's all right. Can't be on 100% of the time. You know that. I know that. We know that, right? Right, right. Oh, look at that little elephant. How sweet. Well, hobo clown who just, dude, why are you trying to be a clown if you're homeless? That's, that's scary. There was another one of those dragon pieces. It was a different color than the plates in the um, the original. I think it was like a, a pitcher. But different color, definitely same maker. That dragon was very familiar. This dude was cool. Look at his little face, his eyes. But, and I, he was a planter, but I, I left him behind. I think we're going to venture over to where the linens are. But honestly, I can tell you right now I struck out. I will say it it was a little funny for me to try to figure out how to get through, especially cuz I'm trying to stay clear of other people. So like can I sneak past you? Yes. Do I want to? Definitely not. Here's me making the executive decision that one is probably better than two. Yeah, so we're going over here. I did not find anything that I really wanted. Um, so yeah, hopefully you guys had fun shopping with me. Um, sorry if I sound a little bit sleepy or weird. Because, um, you know, it's two. 
So, right on. What are you going to do? <laughs> I love you guys. We'll talk to you soon. And uh, thanks for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and uh, do all that do that stuff. Because, you know, all, all of us told you what to do. Right? Right. All right, guys. I love you. Bye.